This is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. The drink package continues to cause issues on cruise ships. Yeah, an incident on a Mediterranean cruise has resulted in a waiter suffering permanent facial injuries after being attacked by a cruise passenger. Now, this is how it played out. The altercation occurred in the main dining room where a 57-year-old passenger from, uh, from Palermo allegedly misused his drink package by ordering drinks for other guests. When a waiter confronted the passenger about his behavior, the passenger poured beer over the waiter's head, but it was the wrong waiter. So he found the waiter and then attacked him with a glass bottle. Now, due to the severity of the assault, the ship's captain decided to disembark the passenger at the next port in Greece. The injured waiter has since filed a complaint with Italian authorities, but the name of the ship has not been released. And the Villa V Odyssey departed from the Harland and Wolf shipyard on Wednesday for sea trials outside of Belfast. Now, after arriving at the facility in late April, the 1993 built vessel spent the last four months preparing for the company's debut, which has been repeatedly pushed back. Villa V has yet to officially share an updated timeline for the ship's definitive departure from Belfast. And Holland America Line has announced new cruise itineraries for Alaska for the year 2026, with trips ranging from 7 to 28 days. Now, the cruise line will operate six ships in the region, Eurodam, Koningsdam, New Amsterdam, Nordam, Westerdam, and Zandam, offering various sailings from April to September of 26. New offerings include a 14-day Great Alaska Explorers Cruise and the return of that 28-day Alaska Arctic Circle Solstice Voyage. Cruises will depart from Seattle, Vancouver, and Whittier. And cruise line stocks were mixed on Wednesday. Carnival Corporation down 1.2%, 16.15. Royal Caribbean down a half percent, 158.77. Norwegian down 1.8%, 17.29. And Viking up 1%, 33.03. Lead on a story, let us know. Tips at cruiseradio.net. Have yourself a great Thursday. Here in Dallas, I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today.